wanted to do a quick video here. Got some exciting stuff here. It's kind of unboxing, not really an unboxing because I've already unboxed it and opened it. But I just wanted to show you this. I uh, received this package the other day. I'm quite excited about it. I'm looking forward to getting stuck into this as a build. This is some of you might recognise, some of you might not. This is a hurricane kit for a North Rival Zeus. So this is a 3D printed kit. The 3D printed parts here. These come from a guy out in California called Out of Darts. Kind of one of the kind of Northers out there came up with this uh, maybe a couple of years ago. I'm not sure, a year and a half. I'm not sure how old the, the design is. Uh, and what it is a kit that slots into the North Rival Zeus. So you've got the North Rival Zeus. This was the flywheel, the kind of flagship flywheel uh, blaster uh, when the Rival line started. Uh, it's a kind of semi auto, uh, semi auto Rival blaster. Uh, really good fun, these things uh, shoot quite hard, they rev up, they take the 12 round rifle magazines, so I've got a bunch of these, they're good fun, but what this does, the Hurricane kit, does away with the need for the magazine, this kind of slots in, and this, you feed the balls into the top here, they come through this top hopper here, and this will hold nearly, I think it's about 90 balls this will hold when it's full. The balls just go around all the tubing, all the way around, up to the top here. There's a blower fan that uh, needs to sit on the top here, and that blows all the balls around into the flywheels down the bottom here. And you can either have keep it semi-auto, or you can make it this you can make this full auto as well. If you've seen uh, my video when I went down to Bristol to meet the guys down at Bristol, the uh, Blastersmiths, the, the Blastersmiths Tech Day, you'll see I had a shot of uh, foam data services. Uh, one of the Brit North modders and one of the best in the business North modders. Uh, he let me have a shot of his uh, Hurricane. I had to be shot. Uh, you've seen that in my video, me shooting that. Fantastic fun. Fell in love with it. And he actually bought the new version of this kit. So he sold me uh, his old kit. So this is the old one that you saw in that other original video. But I've bought that off now and I'm going to get this done. So next thing, next step is I need to, the blaster needs completely overhauled, we need to completely rewire it, we need to put it in a new switch, we need to put in a new ref switch, we need to get it wired for lipo power. There's a transformer, kind of step down transformer that comes. Here's the blower fan here. There's also a circuit board here which uh, takes the current down a wee bit for the blower fan. Uh, obviously the lipo is a bit powerful for that. So that will uh, organise that, blows the, gets the blower fan working correctly, blowing the balls down, and then you've got the lipo power giving the flywheels an extra kick. Uh, so this thing will be absolutely awesome. Full, full auto, full of power. Can't wait to get this going and up and running. This, along with my other rival blasters I have, will make an awesome loadout. This, compared to the North Nemesis that's coming out, the rival Nemesis, the Nemesis holds 100 balls, full auto, but uh, this thing's much better. Holds about the same amount of balls, and it's much much sleeker profile, about half the size. You can sling this, have it on your back, use it for clearing rooms, breaching rooms, emptying emptying hundred balls down into a corridor, whatever. Great fun. Uh, also works a lot better with the blower fan. Loads uh, feeds a lot more consistently. Kind of first reviews of the Nemesis coming out saying the feed mechanism is a bit janky, and yeah, we'll see how it goes. Obviously, I've not not had a Nemesis in my hands, not fired one yet, but. I think the Hurricane's best, better option for me. Much smaller, much more compact, comfy, looks sleeker, does the same job. Anyway, looking forward to it. It's going to be a big build. There's a lot of work to be done on this one. Uh, I'm going to have to, yeah, will be many a night spent rewiring this and getting it all working properly, but it's going to be awesome fun when it's finished. Anyway, can't wait to show you some more footage of this when I get it all done. I'll probably make a wee video of the build and everything. And we'll see what it's like when it's finished. But anyway, thanks for watching. Couldn't wait to share that with you. I'm really excited about this one. Remember, check us out on Facebook. Give us a like. Uh, like and a subscribe on uh, Facebook and YouTube and over on Instagram now as well. We're sticking some stuff up in there. Anyway, thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.